there he is. There he is, he's leaving his apartment now. Mark that down. Okay, it's 3.54 a.m. Leaving apartment. Shh. He can't hear us, dickhead. All right. This guy is so weird. I know, right? Like, who leaves their apartment at 4 a.m.? Why would anyone be awake at 4 a.m.? Well, we are awake. Oh, yeah. Why are you still whispering? Because it's fun. Okay, well, I can barely hear you. Oh, maybe we should get walkie-talkies. No, dude, that's so stupid. You know what? That's actually a pretty cool idea. We should get walkie-talkies. So, because Ryan is an idiot and forgot to pay our cable bill, we were without cable or internet for a couple of days. Turns out our neighborhood is actually quite interesting. In fact, we think we may have a serial killer on our hands. I have tremendous instincts when it comes to crime, as I've seen almost every episode of Kim Possible like a million times, kind of honing my skills, if you will. And I can tell you for certain that this fatso's got people chopped up in his freezer. Ew, dude, why is he taking out so many bags of garbage? It's probably empty food containers. The man's a fucking house. I bet his recycling tub's filled to the brim with empty Chef Boyardee cans. Yeah, that is if he recycles. Oh, add that to the list of possible oh, offenses. Oh, yeah. Probably doesn't recycle. You know, I'm thinking maybe we should invite him up to hang out with us. What? Why? So he can come up and murder us? No. We're a couple of chill, good time dudes. That's we get him up here, get show him a good time, get him all relaxed, get a confession out of him. Oh. Meanwhile, we got the FBI above us and Apache helicopters waiting to storm down and take him in. See, I was on board until the Apache helicopters. You don't think he'd just hear those and freak out? Michael, Michael, Michael. You don't hear an Apache helicopter till they want you to hear it. Oh, and this information is based on what? Your time in the military? I was never in the military. Uh, yeah, all right. Anyway, let's be honest. Do you think that he's killed a human yet or just a couple of cats and dogs? Wow, they always start with animals. That's true. But remember that bitch you used to live with him who always complained about how fast we drove through here? Yes, that lady was definitely a bitch. Well, have you seen her here in a while? Not really, no. Yeah, well, I don't know about you, but I still whip my car through here Vin Diesel Tokyo Drift style like a fucking madman. And I haven't heard a complaint in, I don't know, months. Yeah, it, I haven't heard one in a while. Yeah, it's because she's probably chopped up in his freezer. Yeah, if he didn't already fucking cannibalize her. Ugh, that's probably why he's so fat and smelly. Lay off the human meat, fatso! Yeah, save some for the rest of the cannibals. Ugh. This fat, smelly fuck is going down. We're on to you, buddy boy. And you can bet your stinky ass we're gonna take you down. Ryan is really caught up on revenge, even though we've never met this guy. And yes, he is very fat, but Ryan keeps calling him smelly. And we've never even seen him anywhere but out our window. I'm pretty sure Ryan just believes that all fat people stink. Christy Alley, Yokozuna, Governor Christie, Shrek, Fat Albert, Michael Moore, Chris Farley, pregnant Jessica Simpson, those two short little dudes from the Book of World Records, my cousin Harold, the fat chick from Shallow How, Stay Puft Marshmallow Man, Grimace, they're all fat and they all smell. <laughs> Yo, okay, I got this. We can use it to take pictures for evidence. What's that? My camera. Let me see that. No. Why not? Because you can't. That's your dick pic camera, isn't it? No. Yeah, it is, dude. Why don't you just use your cell phone? It's so much easier. Because a cell phone doesn't give me the look that I desire. Oh, what look is that? Shoot from your asshole up so it looks like your dick is actually bigger than five inches? Ah, uh, well, you know, at least I'm not sending flaccid pictures of my dick to girls. I don't send flaccid dick pics. Yes, you do. How would you know? <sighs> All right, well, this one time, I was looking for something to rip a beat to. Oh, no, And I know dude, you were always God. talking about sending so many dick pics to so many girls, I figured one of them had to reciprocate. Oh, gross, dude. You use my phone to jerk off? Yeah, it wasn't good. I just scrolled through like uh, 70 flaccid dickies till I got to the one chick kind of showing her boobs. Okay, those pictures are not flaccid, and there certainly weren't 70, all right? You gotta give them a couple pumps, wake them up a little bit, then you snap the picture. Why don't you just... Fucking get it all the way hard, like a real man. Cause then what's a girl got to look forward to? If I send her a picture of a full drawn rod, that's what she's gonna be expecting. Then I get in the bedroom and there's no trick photography and she's disappointed in real life. Well, they usually are. Yeah, for you they are, not for me, because I send semi-hard pics. Then there's only one way to go, and that's up.
Ah, well, maybe you should stop sending those semi-hard dick pics to my cousin Harold. Yeah, okay. Why would your cousin Harold be saved in your phone as big old titties? Because he's got big old titties. <sighs> Fuck, whatever. What are we doing with that thing again? I forget. Oh, wait. Maybe I was going to go in the bathroom and send a dick pic. Uh... No, 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 no. We're going to use it to surveil Fatty McKenna oh, across yeah. the street. All right. That's all right. Let's do it. Rock hard to flappy. It's all clear here. Over. Roger, but I definitely did not agree on those nicknames. What's that, Flappy? Stop calling me Flappy. Do you see anything, Flappy? No, asshole. All clear. I didn't copy. I said it's all clear. You said it to who? I didn't copy. I said it to you. Who's you? I didn't copy. I'm not calling you that stupid fucking name, Ryan. Then I'm not gonna copy what you said. Fine. All clear here. Rock hard. Do you copy? Copy that, Flappy. Dude, this is boring. You wanna get drunk while we wait? Copy that, Flappy. Affirmative on the drinking. Oh, it's that lady in 4028 leaving at 1 a.m. again. Probably cheating on her husband. You can grab the walkie-talkies. I'll get the dick pic camera. All right. <laughs> my mom, the other day my mom was like, oh, this is where I was going to do bowling. She goes, don't tell Allie's an idiot. That's all you do is just tell people they're idiots. You tell Ryan that on the show all the time. I'm like, he's the one that writes it, me to tell him he's an idiot. She's like, oh, okay.